So we're flying over the Ohop Creek restoration site a year after miles of a ditch were transformed into a sinuous channel. We're starting to see some early erosion of the banks as the creek is starting to reach uh, equilibrium. And the plantings are starting to take hold, thousands and thousands of plants with protection tubes to keep them from being eaten by the local elk and deer. We see these habitat features already being used by coho salmon and juvenile steelhead over summering and overwintering in the channel. The log jams are starting to take shape and recruit new logs and form pools and areas that salmon can rest and feed. Um, the banks are getting deeper on the outer banks and point bars are developing with some gravel starting to be recruited into the channel. As, we, as the plants mature and take hold in the banks, the channel will reach some equilibrium and we'll start to see shade and more inputs of insects and food for juvenile salmon.